Hey guys, welcome back to another Sunday. I hope that all of you guys are having an amazing day. Hopefully all of you guys are being blessed by the Lord because He's always a blessing God. And I hope that you guys are ready for everything that we have for you guys today. We have a Bible verse, we have a new Bible lesson, and we're going to have worship, alright? So that's the first thing we're going to do. We're going to worship, okay? So I want you guys to stand up, stretch, get ready, because we're about to go praise the Lord. And I'll see you when we get back. You stood before creation Eternity in your hand You spoke the earth into motion My soul now to stand You stood that we have and it's worship so I hope that you guys enjoyed it and I hope that you guys are ready to learn the Bible verse so I want you guys to pay attention I want you guys to practice these moves so don't stay sitting don't stay sitting down stand up once again if you're sitting or stay standing because you're gonna get right into the Bible verse with Miss Zari hi kids 
Hope you guys are ready to learn the Bible verse for this month of July. So if you're sitting down, please stand up. And we're going to first learn the Bible verse in Spanish and then in English. So, let's start off. So, confía en el Señor de todo corazón. Proverbios 3, 5. Let's do that one more time. Confía en el Señor de todo corazón. Proverbios 3, 5. Ahora en inglés, now in English. Trust in the Lord with all your heart. Proverbs 3, 5. Let's do it one more time. So, trust in the Lord with all your heart. Proverbs 3, 5. Okay? See, it was that easy. So, I hope you're practicing at home. And I hope to see you soon. Bye. Thank you, Zari, for the Bible verse. I hope that all of you guys practice that Bible verse. Keep practicing those steps to memorize that verse, okay? So I hope you guys already know it. If you don't, keep on practicing. And right now, we're going to get on to our lesson. So I want you guys to open up your ears, open up that thinking cap so you guys can pay attention and have an imagination with this lesson. So I hope you guys are ready, okay? Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. I'm Aisha, welcome to my cupcake food truck. Look at what I have cooking today. Cool, right? They're my apple armor cupcakes. This one has a little helmet, this one has a little shield. I made them for our story today. Are you ready to hear it? Then on the count of three, yell, tell me a story. One, two, three, tell me a story. Oh wow, look at all the soldiers. What are they wearing? They are wearing armor. Soldiers would put armor on whenever they went into battle. Armor like this would protect them. So cool. <laughs> the Bible teaches us that God gives us armor too. It's true. We can put our armor on every day to help us remember to trust God and go his way. Here, let me show you. Do you know what this is? It's a helmet. That's right. Now, where does a helmet go? On your foot? <laughs> no. On your elbow? <laughs> no. Where does it go? On your head. That's right. Okay, everyone pretend to put on your helmet. Ready? <laughs> awesome. God says when we remember that Jesus is our friend forever, it's like putting on a helmet. We always want to remember that Jesus is our friend. Okay, now, look at this. It's a breastplate. Do you know where this goes on a soldier? On their chest. That's right. It protects their heart. Okay, let's pretend to put one on by thumping our chest. Ready, go! God says when we choose to go God's way, it's like wearing a breastplate to protect us. We always want to remember that God's way is perfect. Okay, last one. <laughs> Do you know what this one is? A shield! Yes! A soldier holds it on their arm so they can block things that might hurt them. Let's pretend to hold our shields. Oh no, here come some arrows. Hold your shield up. Great job. <laughs> God says that when we trust him, it's like holding a shield up to protect us. We always want to remember to trust God. So, now we've got a helmet, a breastplate, and a shield. And do you know what else you've got? You've got God's word, the Bible. <laughs> you can read this every day and it will teach you how to go God's way. And remember, God's way is the best way. So we can trust God. Did you like the story? If you did, give it two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. Hey there, Ollie, tell me.
Who can trust God? I can trust God. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who can trust God? I can trust God. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. See you next time. Bye. All right, everyone, that's all we have for today. I hope that all of you guys enjoyed everything that we had for you guys today. And I hope that you guys are ready for the activities that you guys are going to do later today. And I hope that you guys just enjoyed this video and learned something new. And I hope that you guys keep practicing the Bible verse. And I'll see you guys next time, okay? Bye!